Hey, good morning, Acadiana. Remember Bridget Tichette? Well, we're here with her and her personal trainer, James Albers, to get an update on her fitness journey. So James, give us an update on Bridget's fitness journey. To date, Bridget's lost 63 pounds, 14% body fat, and 34 inches. In the last four weeks, we've really increased our intensity. She's lost 11 pounds, 0.4% body fat, and she's lost five and a half inches. Hey, what type of nutrition program are you using to help Bridget on her fitness journey? The program we have is High Tech Trainer. It's a software program that we use. It's an individualized meal plan program, and she's on a 1,300 calorie, low fat program, and it's working absolutely fantastic. What type of training regimen have you guys been using in the last five months? What we do is we work together and we train every major muscle group. We do weightlifting 30 minutes and we really kick the intensity up. After that, we jump into the cardio and we really focus on burning calories and burning fat. We got together and we evaluated her body fat percentage first and foremost. Then we went out into the gym and we used a three rep maximum to establish her strength capability. We got in the cardiovascular room and we did a test on her target heart rate to establish that for her cardio program. We did a sit and reach test to establish her flexibility and we used that as a baseline to design her program. Okay. Now Bridget wants to lose 125 pounds, but she's lost 62 pounds already in just five months. What type of client is she? She's the ideal client. She's perfectly dedicated. She keeps herself accountable to her meal plan. She logs on the high tech trainer and logs her meals daily. She's very consistent with the cardiovascular program. She's very dedicated to her workout program. I wish every client had the motivation that Bridget has. Hey, that's from the trainer. Don't let your health take a back seat. Get motivated, get moving, and keep fitness first. Want to see that again? Log on to klfy.com to see this week's episode.